Hi. Today let's take a look at a feature that's been in Microsoft Dynamics GP since it was created. Checklist. We're going to particularly look at the receivables management checklist. I'm in the sales series and under routines you'll see checklist. So let's open that up. Now here you can see all the modules that exist in the sales series, receivables management, invoicing, and sales order processing along with the frequency of the checklist. So we're going to start with the month end checklist and you can see it's already preset for us. And to follow the checklist along you just double click on each item and the appropriate window will open up. So you can age, see how simple that was? And you can see that it time stamps and lists the user that did the transaction. And if the next step that I want to do is transfer commissions, I'll click on that and that window will open and I can process there as well. And you can see it timestamps everything. If there's a task that you do not do on a regular basis, such as finance charge, you could highlight it and delete it from the list. But be careful about clicking the revert button in the bottom right hand corner because once you revert, it'll revert everything back to the way the checklist was out of the box. Now one thing that you may want to do from receivables is go to the daily checklist and create your own checklist of things that you want to do in receivables on a daily basis. And to create your checklist, we'll simply click on add. And if the first thing we want to do is enter customer payments, this happens to be a Microsoft Dynamics GP window as opposed to an external task or a GP macro. Then under application, we'll do a lookup and we'll find the appropriate GP window and this one happens to be cash receipts when entry. I'll click OK and OK again. Now how do I know that's the window that I wanted? I'm going to just double click on it to open it up as opposed to going to it through transaction entry. If you look you'll see in the title bar across the top it says cash receipts entry. That's the actual name of the window so that will be what I need to look up. So if you know the window you want to add that's where you will want to do it. So let's take um, a look at finding a, the appropriate window we want that way. If part of my process that I want to do daily is to age my receivables, I open up the window and I can see the name of it then, Receivables Aging Process. So let's go back to the checklist. On the daily checklist, we're going to add a new entry and I'll call it Age AR. Again, it is a Microsoft Dynamics GP window and then I'll find the window. So that was called Receivables aging process and there's the window name. So I'll click OK and OK again and now I have that window available to me so I can then add aging to my window. You could add any GP window you want including GP macros and an external task. If you want to add an Excel spreadsheet for example one of the things that you do need to be aware of is that once you find the file, let me pull up a spreadsheet there we go. Let's find one. Any spreadsheet will do. Okay. What you need to do then, it, because the application is also a required field, I'll just call this Excel spreadsheet, is you need to map your way out to find the Excel.exe file. And this will be located in your program, whoop, your program file folder. So keep that in mind that you have to actually launch the application and sometimes finding it is a bit of a chore. There it is. So you have to actually tell it where the Excel.exe file is to open up Excel and then you can tell it which file to open in Excel. So I'll simply add that to our list and double clicking it would open up the Excel document. So don't forget to take advantage of using your checklist then you could even add your checklist to your toolbar at the top. Let's add it to the toolbar at the top. So I'm going to click on customize and I'm going to add it to my main toolbar. We'll click on add and in this case it would be under come on, tools, routines, sales, checklist. We'll click OK. And then this option, whoop, here it is, would add it to my check, pull up my checklist for me automatically. Let GP help you work a lot easier. Not everything has to be hard.
Hope this helps.